Well, my name is Bernard Palfrey, P-A-L-F-R-E-Y, and I worked at the factory close to 40 years. The plant is located roughly there, 40, 47 acre plant. Well, I was working, we were working the night shift. We used to work 12 midnight to 8 o'clock in the morning. And the job was to go in and maintain uh, engineering plant. So we were basically shift, uh, we were maintenance people. The first incident was when we noticed well, I noticed that there was a lot of, of uh, production workers walking past me and they were being evacuated. So we, my, the pipe fitters mate I had with me, Dennis Davis, and I wandered down there and opened the, the door and looked out and looked at the bank to see the road tanker ablaze. And we then decided to go up there and see what we could do to help. And the butane plant operator, who there was only one person on, and his job was to look after the plant. And he was in a state of shock as well, but he managed quite rightly to turn the sprays on. He got that right, he, he did that properly. We then went over to see what had happened, and there was a, an enormous explosion when the roof lifted off the discharge house. We then took evasive action and went back down to the works because it was then I decided that I couldn't cope with it on my own and I needed further help. And we went up there and we, tried, we did our best to, to, to find out how we could help. And it was then that we decided that we had to get on top of the uh, storage vessels and, and run to the sprays and turn the vents off, the valves to the vents, because they were a source of uh, ignition. When the fire brigade eventually got there, they sprayed water on the road tanker to keep it cool. It was then that we then had to go back down to the works to get uh, blanks and, and tools and, and, and to enable us to blank off all the, the, the pipework that was damaged. We believe that if we hadn't have done what we did when we did it, it would have been a catastrophe over the city of Hereford. We, we had a, a meal for which the senior engineer had, had paid for us in, in the canteen to thank us for what we'd done. But having said that, afterwards, it was just taken for granted that we'd, we'd done our job on the day. In truth, uh, they really cranked down on safety in some order. 